Bono, uh, we got, as Tom Brands says, you know, one of your favorites, Tom Brands, right? It's a hornet's nest out there, right? It's going to be a hostile environment. How excited are you to get your guys out there and, and test them? Yeah, I wish I was competing. You know, this is the environment you want to be in. This is why we're here. You know, we're coming out to Pennsylvania where some of the best wrestling is, and we're going to be in a packed gym. Uh, and these guys from Edinburgh are going to try to, you know, rip our necks off. So we got to go out there and be ready to fight. When, you know, in the travel, I talked to Reader about the travel, and, the, you know, we're preparing these guys for life. You guys are. No question about it. Like, these guys are going to excel past people when it comes to corporate world or whatever world they go into. Right. When you build this schedule like this, what's the thought in mind? San Diego last yeah. week, New York, Pennsylvania. So, this for week. us, this, with this team, it's about camaraderie. We feel like we have a special team or can have a special team, at the, you know, when March comes. I want these guys on the road. We love being on the road. But, you know, Reader and I and our staff, we love being on the road. We love the hotel life. We love the working out the facilities you know we, we love the hotel life because it's a grind right it's a little tougher um to win on the road and uh that's what we like we got to teach these guys to win on the road hey you don't win a national title or a big 10 championship at home you got to win them on the road so we teach them how to do it on the road early build some com camaraderie with our team um and then we uh come in these hostile environments to teach them to, uh, you better be ready to go I look at the last like eight to ten years of Chris Bono's life, and we were just talking about you used to you were you would work with arthroscopic surgery and and scopes, and you did all this other stuff. You were in sales. You were the head coach at Chattanooga. This is just such a, it's been such a crazy adventure. Does this even see, re, seem real? No, that you're a salesman. It doesn't seem real because I'm finally at a place. Uh, you know, I'm at a place now where it can all happen. You know what I mean? You, you're always looking to get to the next place. Everywhere I was, you know, uh, you know, you always you always had your eye on the next job. So it's nice now that I don't have to do that. I'm sitting right here focusing on my guys, building for, you know, five, six, eight, seven, eight, nine, ten years down the road, um, and not worrying about what's next, you know. So it's 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 awesome. Uh, Wisconsin is an awesome place. And uh, you know, I'm 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 just fired up that I finally am in a place that uh, you know, where we can win the national title and uh, and work our tails off and keep competing. When you're in, you're at your end all be all, right? That's that's you're it. your final destination. That's this right. is it, right? That's right. Retirementville, right? right? Like right. this is where it's going to be till it's over. I, I sure hope so. Okay, so I, with the way that you guys your guys competing, I, I don't think anything different to be honest with you. But when we talk about this, people are talking trophy team this year. Your two trophy team, you know, you know, looking like a genius right now. You know that, but. It's November. We right, get that, right? right? But, you know, you got three guys. you got three big guys. How do you bring everybody else along? Right. How do you get four, five, six, yeah. seven All-Americans well, to get all, a trophy? First of all, I'm not a genius, right? we gotta, we got to step back there, you know. We'll, um, we'll chill on it. Okay. Right, yeah. but Pretty no, smart guy, though. It is um, the, the three – our three guys that are highly ranked have really brought brought some of these guys up a level. A level. Um, like I said, you know, 125, 140 um, – 125, 157, 174 – um, 184 and 197 uh, is going to be how our season goes, right? We get any productivity out of those guys, we're going to have a great season. You know, I'm real confident um, in, in, the, in the guys that have been there, right? We've got a ton of seniors on our team. I'm confident in those guys. How we do with those weight classes uh, will determine whether we get a trophy or not. And, you know, it's, uh, it's not about getting the trophy. It's about getting their best, you know, I want to see their best effort. They give me their best hustle and their best effort. We'll live with the results. But I really think the results can be good if we, uh, if we, if we get this thing going on all cylinders. You look at the Army match last week. You get caught in a mixer at the end of one of yeah. the matches, and some stuff doesn't go your way. You win the match, though. Yeah. What know, does that say? Uh, first of all, Army's a tough team, right? Wait, 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 wait. People are going to be surprised when they wrestle Army. I knew we were going to fight. I knew it. I knew when we first, uh, you know, saw we were going to wrestle them. I knew what they had. And uh, and the matchups were, you know what I mean? They were, they were great matchups in favor of them. Um, we get upset in one match. We don't get bonus points at 65. Um, we don't get bonus points, I think, somewhere else, right? It, it really could have been, you know, 6.8 point, could have been a 9, 10 point difference if we had done what we should have done. But we get upset. Uh, 125 was very, very controversial, right? We had a controversial win. We know that. Um, so it was, it, was, it was a good early season duel meet. You know, win or lose, uh, our guys fought, you know, and they fought and they brought it. And it was, it was uh, luckily we came out on, on, on the winning side. Did you get to have any fun in San Diego? No, there's no, I mean, what's fun, right? You, you make it. My fun is getting up in the morning and working out. You know, I had a lot of fun. I got to work out every morning, got to go outside and run. Beach. You know, the guys I mean? get no, on the beach. No beach. Our fun was, where, you know, our guys had, had a little bit of fun. We got to tour the midway. You know what I mean? But as, a, as, as for me, I go on the road, I work out, I get ready for the next match, right? You, 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 you throw a little food in you to make sure you're living, you know, and then you get back to work and do what you got to do to get ready to make sure your guys are 100% uh, prepared to win. That's what my job is on the road.
All right. Speaking of the job, you got to get in there and coach you guys up. You got anything else for me? No. Just excited you're here. Always like your coverage. Hey, thanks for the time. All right. Jump around Let's tonight. go, right? Jump Let's around. go. On Wisconsin, right. what, are we, what are we ending Let's with? Let's go. Everything. Jump around. Let's go. And uh, <laughs> let's make sure we get it done. Good luck tonight. All right. Thanks.